A Philologist for the Environment is an international interdisciplinary project carried out by the Philological School of Higher Education in Wrocław in partnership with the Faculty of Science and Engineering of the Norwegian Sokdokfjodn University College. Mam tę przyjemność powitać Państwa na konferencji podsumowującej realizacji projektu Filolog dla Środowiska. The conference was part of a one-week seminar organized to sum up the project. The meeting was opened by the rector of the Philological School of Higher Education, Professor Norbert Murciniec. Specjalistyczny projekt rozszerzenia studiów filologicznych o treści interdyscyplinarne powstał z świadomości, że rozwój nowoczesnej uczelni nie może odbywać się w oderwaniu od otoczenia społecznego i od oczekiwań przyszłych pracodawców. Rzeczą, którą szczególnie chciałabym podkreślić jest to, że nie byłoby tego projektu, gdyby nie podstawowa idea, czyli to, żeby nie tylko treści środowiskowe odnosić dosłownie do materii, do wiedzy, ale też do budowania na podstawie tej wiedzy i świadomości pewnej ekologicznej wrażliwości. The project included strengthening the institution's potential by putting together a strategy for pro-ecological development. The Green Strategy was based on research, standards and inspirations adopted from the partner university and constitutes a basis for expanding WSF principles with management procedures embracing care for the natural environment and the institution's influence on its condition and preservation. By including the environmental aspect into managing, WSF joined a group of socially responsible entities, developing conscious attitudes of respect and responsibility for the natural environment among the academic community and closest milieu. Jako koordynator projektu po 17 miesiącach na dwa tygodnie przed zakończeniem projektu muszę Państwu powiedzieć, że jestem dumna z tego, co wypracowane zostało, z tego, co przygotowali nasi wykładowcy i z czystym sumieniem podpiszę się pod każdym z tych produktów. Among other factors, the project results were achieved thanks to the combination of professional didactic supervision from WSF and the subject matter potential of the partner. The title was a philologist for the environment. And uh, the first thing that I thought of, well, a philologist for the environment, something is wrong here. Something like this. It was actually possible to do this. And I think the title now also makes sense. A philologist for the environment, because that is what we somehow try to educate or give you the opportunity yourself to educate. And when we had this, work, uh, this seminar at Atle in Norway, that we saw that actually those philologists were able to give their contribution to this environmental thought. From the beginning, the project goals were to address the need of equipping philologists with modern specialist tools that would make them stand out on the job market, as well as consciously and consequently building the image of WSF as a prestigious, modern and socially responsible university, in this case particularly in the environmental aspect. Thirty modern study programs for teaching specialist foreign languages basing on environmental content have been created within this project, and over 1,000 teaching hours have been conducted for these new courses. During the conference, teachers and students from all majors available at WSF presented the goals and results of project activities undertaken in the ECO courses from the Language for Specific Purposes People in the Environment module.
Students of the teaching specialization and their instructor presented how to successfully incorporate environmental content into foreign language teaching so that a pro-ecological attitude can be developed at an early age. The effective combination of proficient language skills, high social competence and ability to use advanced information and communication technology for education and work plays a decisive role in preparing WSF students for carrying out interesting projects, including interdisciplinary ones, and finding attractive job opportunities after graduation. That's why the project involved equipping the audiovisual lab for WSF students and staff and upgrading the e-learning studio. It was on the e-learning platform where we put online eco-courses and subject matter glossaries created by WSF academic staff and the environmental knowledge compendium put together by representatives of the partner. The joint interdisciplinary project has also been a great opportunity for representatives of different academic fields to get to know each other, as well as for communication and cooperation in an international environment. What was the attractiveness of this material is because uh, this was uh, something new, something interesting and that uh, at least I and I think also Matthias uh, really would like to take a part of. Being there uh, at this uh, beach, having philologists talk about biodiversity, uh, function and ecosystems uh, and these things, it was amazing. And they did a very good job. Among conference speakers were project coordinators, representatives of the partner, and all groups engaged in carrying out the project instructors, students, and WSF e learning specialists. Thanks to the variety of presentations and active participation of the audience, it was possible to present the project and evaluate it from different perspectives, share experiences and comments on project activities, and finally, provide some possible answers to the question, how to preserve the results that we have achieved together. koniec projektu niestety będzie za dwa tygodnie, ale to nie powinien być koniec wykorzystania rezultatów tego projektu i to nie powinien być koniec naszej współpracy, naszych relacji i zaszczepiania odwagi do otwierania się na nowe, nieoczywiste rozwiązania, ale w ogólnym rozrachunku jednak bardzo cenne, o czym mówiliśmy z różnej perspektywy.